ਕੀਤੀ ਮੁਹੰਮਦ ਬਸ਼ੀਰ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਜੀ ਸਰ ਜੀ ਆਪ ਸ਼ੁਰੂ ਕੀਜੀਏ ਸਰ 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 ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ ਵੈਰੀ ਮਚ ਸਰ ਵਾਈਲ ਡਿਸਕਸਿੰਗ ਇਸ ਡਿਮਾਂਡ ਸਪਲੀਮੈਂਟਰੀ ਡਿਮਾਂਡ ਫॉर ਗਰੈਂਡ ਸਰ ਵੀ ਮਸਟ ਬੀ ਪ੍ਰਪੇਅਰਡ ਫॉर ਐਨ ਇਨਟਰੋਸਪੈਕਸ਼ਨ ਔਨ ਟੂ ਥਿੰਗਸ ਨੰਬਰ 1 whether the money allotted as a budget or a supplementary demand for various schemes whether it is properly spent and really attain the achievement second thing whether the country have at least or partially succeeded in reducing the reducing the growth inequality between economically allied group and the downtrodden section of the society so now coming to my first point yesterday in this house the report of the standing committee on social justice and environment ministry of minority affairs presented the report so if you go through that report you will be you will have a kind of guilty conscience so committee narrated how badly the budget allocation is handled it tells you the story of unspent underspent of allocation surrendering of the budget allocation in the end of the year committee also says that implementation of various scheme for the minorities that is they are taking a kind of lukewarm attitude Kambeti even stated that they have miserably failed in utilizing budget allocation. Those who read this report may surprise whether this department is dead or alive. That is the situation, sir. Sir, I would like to say that. Who is responsible for this? And what is exactly the reason for this bad place? I would like to say that we need not blame only the department policy of the government is also responsible for this actually what is happening sir with regard to this minority kind of activities government makes implements and stumbling block in the way of implementing the things sir because of the negative attitude of the government towards this section what is happening they are pushed into unendurable hardship that is actually i will tell you a glaring example sir with regard to the scholarship class 1 to 8 pre matric then maulana azad fund uh, scholarship and uh, the fellowship this two, two schemes were very useful for the for the education upliftment of this marginalized section but they ha- you have curtailed that you are taken away that sir in malayalam there is a phrase picha chattil kayittu vaaya it means that grabbing and snatching from the uh, begging bowls that is happening in respect of them sir so it is to be corrected you are speaking uh, this uh, uh, chatting the mantra of sabka sa sabka vikas is it true it is only a lip exercise happening in this sir sir students are educating yesterday we went there i went there saw the students girls and boys sir i asked that police officer for what purpose you have brought them here they shouted slogans sir we call india as the mother of the democracy in such a country if they shout slogans why they are arrested sir that is happening in this case also sir in that case that is there now coming to my second point that is growth inequality sir i caught from the World Inequality Report 2022 that says i quote according to the World Inequality Report 2022 india stands out as one of the most unequal countries in the world with widespread poverty and along with the affluent elite the report points out that in 2021 the top 10% held 57% of the total wealth in the country while share of the bottom 50 was just 13% oxfam india report on inequality finds that 
The richest of 90, richest 98 Indians own the same wealth as bottom 552 million people. The, the COVID pandemic has uh, created some difference. In addition to that, it says that all these points are uh, uh, with the billionaires. So I am coming to the other thing. Instead of taking effective steps to control the things, what the government is doing, they are widening the inequality, sir. Now again, coming back to the minorities and SCST, most worrisome thing is what, sir? National integration, communal harmony, peaceful coexistence. It is vanishing from the horizon of India. That is what is happening, sir. Sir, we have to realize, Indian freedom movement, even that is polluted, sir. You are rewriting the history, which is an offense you are doing. Mind of young generation is polluted, sir. Textbooks are rewritten. History books are rewritten. That is happening in this, sir. sir. Body, authentic body, sir. Let me just take one no, minute. Please. Yeah, one minute, sir. NCERT, UGC, ICHR, universities are all headed by the person having vested interest, sir. Selection to the higher post are not on the basis of merit or their uh, credential. It is on the basis of political consideration only, sir. The legislation are taking place in different states, sir. Different legislation, anti law jihad, and anti conversion. This kind of legislation is of what? Only to create confusion and unrest in this country, sir. I don't want to take much of the side. What I'm asking is, government should be serious in this, sir. Government should not have party. Government should not have partisan attitude. Government is for the people. I will try to tell you. There may be some ideology you may like or dislike. That should not be the criteria in deciding. Only one, I quote from Mahatma Gandhi's quoting. Mahatma Ji told, you have to do the right thing. You Shri may Jagdundi never know Kapalji. what result come from that. So that is the thing. So what in brief, sir, condoling, I am asking justice for the minorities. And down to our you should not do this kind of injustice to them. Sir, with a few words, I can.